farmer, Sharon Rupsing, usually produces pink and white sorrel. But this year, she said sorrel harvesting was a challenge for many sorrel farmers as the weather conditions were unfavorable. The pink and white sorrel are so delicate. Too much rain would cause them to wilt up and, and dry up and die. Also, we had a lot of problems with the phytophthora and root rot. So this year, the crop production was not as best. And though the numbers are not what they expected, she said after the season, many forget about the festive plant. But events like the sorrel melee keep it blooming all year. The artisans would produce so much more with the sorrel, being soaps and cheesecakes and bread and cakes and so. So we are thinking that sorrel could be used year-round rather than just at Christmas time. There are healthier ways to extract the juice from the sorrel. Ms. Rup Singh said there's a no-boil method that can be used. It is like putting, putting all the spices with the sorrel petals in a glass jar or bottle. You can repurpose ketchup bottles or moby bottles. And then you pour hot water on that and you leave it for a period of one day or a day and a half. Once this is done, she said the sorrel can be strained and sweetened to your liking. She explained that by using this method, chemical reactions from metal pots can be avoided. Ms. Rup Singh said the no-boil method gives the sorrel a better flavor. Mahalia Joseph Wharton, TTT News.